नमस्ते बच्चों हमेशा खुश हो माई सेल्फ जीविन डॉक्टर मोनिका त्रिवेदी एंड टू दिस टॉपिक इज ऑक्सीडेशन ऑफ हाइड्रेसिंस सो द हाइड्रेसिंस कैन रिएक्ट विद वन इलेक्ट्रॉन ऑक्सी ऑक्सीडेंट सच एज अक्यूप्रिक एंड फेरिक आयन टू गिव अनस्टेबल एज ओ कंपाउंड विच डिकम्पोज विद लूज ऑफ नाइट्रोजन टू द हाइड्रो कार्बन हेयर यू कैन सी the phenyl hydrazine uh, in presence of copper plus 2 will give the unstable as a compound uh, after the losing of nitrogen to the hydrocarbon okay so the aryl hydrazine aryl hydrazine are oxidized uh, differently by the two uh, electron oxidation such as a chlorine and the bromine to the diazonium salt okay As you can see, phenyl hydrazine in presence of two mole of chlorine, it will give the diazonium salt. Okay, the N positive triple bond N Cl is known as a diazonium bond. So it will give the diazonium salt. Another example in presence of Br two, it will give the diazonium. so so this is n and dash uh, di substituted hydrazine gives the as a compound readily so uh, there is another example you can see that the um, as a hydrazine group is here and the um, after the losing the two moles of hydrogen it convert into the as a uh, bond so um, it can easily n n di substituted hydrazine okay this is n n di substituted hydrazine presence of ago mercury oxide it will give the as a compound this as a base isobutyl and i think this uh, ai bn compound okay the next topic is oxidation of uh, sulfides so the oxidation of sulfide it can be oxidized by both the uh, sulfoxide and the sulfones okay most uh, reagent uh, which will oxidize uh, a sulfide will also oxidize uh, this kind of uh, reactions okay so there is a useful uh, reaction like the uh, sulfide in presence of per acid h2o2 or nao4 it will give sulfoxide okay and uh, it if we further uh, oxidize it with the h2o2 it will give a sulfone okay and after uh, it will uh, the final product is sulfone this can also done by the uh, cheminophore and the ch3co h per acid okay so uh, although the oxidation of the sulfide and sulfoxide uh, with the hydrogen peroxide can be accomplished in the presence of the another uh, oxidizing oxidable groups such as a tertiary um, uh, tertiary amino and um, uh, carbon double bond carbon carbon double bond uh, so uh, uh, this kind of uh, oxidation process is uh, uh, not easily uh, uh, um, present so the so over the oxidation the uh, sulfoxide or to the sulfone it can be occur so the mechanism of the oxidation of mcpba involves a nucleophilic attack to the Uh, sulfide ion on the per acid there is a mechanism of um, uh, pre pre preparation of the sulfone okay what happen you can see here the uh, lone pairs on the uh, sulfur will attack on the per acid and the after the delocalization do localization of a bond rearrangement of a bond you will find the r as positive o negative and r and plus a r uh, c o h so uh, this is the intermediate state now uh, the another another example h2o2 or the mg pbr you will get the sulfur okay so the sulfur oxide are the tetra uh, tetra hydride in a shape with the two carbon Uh, groups in the oxygen and the lone pairs or the electrons uh, when two carbon group or the non equivalent r is not equivalent to the r dash then the sulf the sulfoxide is a chiral this is the sulfoxide okay the sulfo if you can see the here the sulfoxide is a is a it has a chiral chiral center so 
In this kind of reaction, the MCPV and uh, H2O2 and O3 are a good oxidizing agent, and it will convert uh, the uh, in presence of uh, this kind of uh, reagent, um, the oxidation of uh, uh, tertiary butyl hydroperoxide in the presence of the titanium tetra isopropoxide uh, and the positive RR di diethyl tetrate. Okay, so uh, this is the um, reagent you can see here and you will get the uh, 90% of uh, sulfoxide okay the sulfoxide group here so um, uh, it is uh, uh, formulated that the oxidization of the sulfoxide to uh, sulfide to the sulfoxide can be controlled as so as to stop the uh, sulfoxide stage. Okay, this is because the oxidation of sulfoxide uh, to the sulfone is uh, generally slower than the oxidation of the sulfur sulfide to the sulfoxide. Okay, the reactivity uh, difference is to be expected with the oxidizing agents such as MCPBR which uh, which are electrophilic electrophilic uh, sulfoxide are bonded to be less uh, nucleophilic than the, sulf uh, the sulfide as they are more hindrance and uh, also have an electron withdrawing uh, oxygen attack to the sulfur atom so here you can see the another example in presence of uh, MCPB a or H2O2 and ACOH, you will get the sulfoxide and on the axis of uh, oxygen, okay, you will find the uh, sulfones over here. So, um, this is the strong oxidizing agent, okay. Uh, you can see the another example of, uh, if you use the MCPB in an axis, you will get the sulfone or it can convert into the, if you, if you take the small amount of the MCPBA, you will get the sulfoxide and if you uh, use it in a uh, excess way, you will get the sulfone here. So, in presence of uh, Kamen or 4, um, it is uh, sulfox uh, the sulfoxide is always more than the sulfides. Okay, so um, uh, you will uh, definitely find, you uh, if you can see this reaction. Okay, uh, so this is... Um, this is the first reaction and this is the second reaction it is a, uh, like if it is explained in a cyclic way okay so uh, the reactant is a kmno4 on uh, on a 30 degree centigrade it uh, will convert this um, uh, sulfoxide to the sulfones if we further use the both sulfur uh, are oxidized and it will give the uh, four moles of uh, cell phones okay so if you use mcpba in an axis you will get the cell phone from the sulfoxide okay so uh, the uh, this this kind of uh, reactivity is due to the nucleophilic characteristics of the oxidant mno negative 4 this oxi oxidant prefer to react first with the electrophilic sulfoxide rather than the nucleophilic sulfide so, using uh, KMnO4, it is possible to oxidize sulfoxide to the cell phone in the presence of the cell phone. Okay, thank you very much.